Hey, what's going on, guys? Today I got an awesome trick for you. It uses a slight setup, uh, but I think you guys are going to like it. Now, of course, as with all my tricks, it uses a deck of cards. And uh, what I'm going to do is spread them out. Now, this is a very similar to an any card, any number trick. And uh, basically, obviously, we're going to need a lucky number and a card. So, and I have my very lucky card here. And that's going to help generate uh, a lucky number for us. Now, to be honest, guys, this isn't really that lucky. All it is is a joker, but what makes it so special is that it actually has some color on it, just like that. Now, we now have two cards generated. Let's see, we have a 3 and a 9. Now, there's not 93 cards in the deck, so I guess we'll be using the number 39. So that is our lucky number. Now, we have a lucky number. Let's generate... A card. Now the spectator would then take the Joker, place it anywhere they'd like in the cards, and uh, let's say right there, we simply go right to where those cards is, right where the Joker is, and we take a look at what they have here. Let's uh, use this card for the value and this card for the suit. The value of the card is going to be an 8, and the suit of the card is going to be a club. So, the 39th card should be the 8 of clubs. Now, let's see how this works out for us. Ready? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39th card, 8 of clubs. Yes, it is, just like that. Now, that's the trick. Let's learn that, and uh, let's see. Now, what you're going to need, I can just throw that deck away, because uh, this deck right here is all set up, and it is in the Psy 7 stack. And that's exactly what you're going to need to set your deck up in Psy 7 stack. Now, I do have a, there'll be a link on the screen and in the description for uh, a link on how to set your deck up in the size 7 stack. It's not too hard, pretty simple. You will need all 52 cards. And then what you also want to get from another deck is an extra 3 and an extra 9. doesn't matter what, you know, if these are diamonds and clubs, it could be the same. Uh, it doesn't really matter. Alright? So you get these, you place these on the top and the bottom of your deck. And once you have that, you're ready to go. So, once again, you have it in the size step and stack. You have your 3 and your 9. Obviously, those are from a different deck. should be the same backs. And uh, those are on top and bottom. You will need one joker. doesn't matter. could be actually any card. Um, could have a different back. And, uh, well, now let's get started. What you have to do is you're going to spread the cards out. And you're basically going to be forcing the top and bottom card. Now, this isn't too difficult. You tell your spectator you have a really lucky card. You place it in the center. Now, when you, you're going to close the deck up. And here's the secret move. You're going to spread through until you get to that joker. You're going to take the joker, turn it your whole hand over. So, notice I'm taking my whole hand, turning it over, putting that joker right on the top of the deck. So, this is the top of the deck. The joker's going right on the top of the deck. I'm turning my hand back around and placing this on top just like that. Now what that has done is, well, generated a lucky number. They think it's actually random, but really you have now forced them the 3 and the 9. So once you have done that, you now want to get a selection. This isn't too hard. You have them place in the joke. It could be anywhere they want. Let's say it was right here. They can change their mind if they want. So right here put those off to the side. Now one small move you just make, you take the bottom of the deck and you just put it right on top of the top. Okay, And that just makes sure everything will work out mathematically. Now uh, now that you have your two selections, one thing you gotta remember is that the bottom card is always going to be the value of the card and this card right here will be whether it's clubs, hearts, spades, or diamonds. So our value is going to be the 10 and our suit is going to be the spade. So the 10 of spades should be in the 39th card. And, well, let's see if this works. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 7, 28, 29, 30. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 39th card. 10 of spades. Works every single time. I think it's fabulous. Uh, that's the trick. I hope you guys liked it. 
Remember, I'll be back.